welcome back to my channel and today we're going to do a little fridge clean out because I have been very, very, very busy all week. I have uh, been seeing clients, I've been doing training for a job that I got, so I just, I've been all over the place and I have not had time to take care of my beautiful fridge. So on the inside, there are probably many disgusting things. So right now, I just got groceries delivered, so I put them in there real quick, but I'm going to take everything out gonna give it a good clean. First I'm gonna clean out the food that like is probably not good anymore. Now take it out, give it a good clean, and I'll take you guys on the journey. If you like videos like this to get you inspired to clean and organize your home, don't forget to subscribe. Just press that subscribe button, it's totally free. And if you subscribe, you will feed a Cavalier, King Charles Spaniel, and he will be so grateful that you support him. His name is Clover, and he loves all of you guys. He really does. All right, let's uh, Let's do this. You know, the first thing I do when I clean is to put on some good music. So it had been a while since I had been in the fridge and cleaned it out and it was looking very scary and packed of old food. So the first thing I did was take out all of that old food and the food that had like starchy stuff as its base, I had to put in the trash because I heard from a plumber you're not supposed to put it down at the garbage disposal or it could get all gummed up and terrible. So I put it in the trash and immediately took out the trash because that is how we roll in the house. We don't like to have trash hanging out too long, getting all smelly and gross. And then you guys know me, I always like to take this opportunity to go ahead and clean the trash can because the trash can's really gross. And this was my method antibacterial spray, so it get rid of some germs and cleaned at the same time. I had also forgotten that I hadn't emptied the dishwasher, so I couldn't put any of that food storage container action that I had put on the counter in the dishwasher. So I just quickly emptied the dishes and put the old dishes into the dishwasher. So I was going back to this monstrosity and I just decided just to go ahead and take food out that was super old and disgusting. And I discovered an old drink in there, which I was grossed out about, but I have this really cool stainless steel set of straws and I thought I'd show you guys. We got it off Amazon, link in the description. These herbs were a couple of weeks old, so they had had a really good run, but this parsley was just like frozen and had some burn on it. It just was bad, but it kept for, I think at least two weeks, nice and fresh inside a little vase and covered with a plastic bag. And that is how I store most of my herbs and they do really well that way. Um, the ones that are sensitive anyway, like basil, parsley and uh, mint. Anyway, went in with a wet microfiber cloth with nothing on it except for some water and went ahead and got clean. Some of the surfaces that had had some gunk on them, on the insides of the doors, especially where there were drinks spilling and stuff like that. Cleaning with microfiber cloth and just water is one of the more effective ways you can clean your fridge without having your fridge smell like cleaner after you do it, you know what I mean? Because I don't like my food to smell like either like a fragrant cleaner or any kind of stuff like that. So if I just go in with a microfiber cloth, just put some water on it, I can very easily pick up grime, pick up germs, and not have it smell disgusting and weird afterward. <laughs> anyway, we had a lot of eggs. I'm not really sure why. I put them in this container, which is from Inner Design. I've had it in a few other videos. I will link it down below if you're interested in purchasing it, but it's great because you can store things on top of it. I also forgot to label the back. The back is where I had this reusable erasable sticker. You can write on it with Sharpie, the expiration date of any food, and it's also, um, dishwasher safe so if you put whatever thing you put the sticker on in the dishwasher it won't come off it is awesome I also took it as a time to change my blue apple inserts it was definitely time I think it was a week overdue these are little apples that eat 
ethylene gas, well, they don't eat it. They just neutralize it and turn it into carbon dioxide because that is the stuff that makes your vegetables and fruits spoil faster. So I have two in the ethylene producer's drawer and one in the ethylene sensitive drawer, and that seems to work for us. I was ready to put the finishing touches on the fridge, just a little more cleaning with a different microfiber cloth. I got kind of grossed out, so I switched microfiber cloths, and since my mushrooms that I had got delivered this morning from the grocery store had come in a plastic bag, I put them in a paper bag, because according to the mushroom guy at the farmer's market, that is how you're supposed to store them. And one more time, with a good clean, of any of the spots that had acquired some nastiness with a microfiber cloth just moistened with some water. finished let's see how we did Yay! so we did it's much better now there's not like a bunch of leftovers in here um, some of those have been in here an embarrassingly long time but um, I've got my zones set up so we've got beverages and some other weird stuff over here um, already you I know some of my viewers are from Canada what is this <laughs> This is something that um, my husband's family like gives to him when they come to visit uh, from Montreal. What What is it? Leave it in a comment down below. <laughs> um, but it's uh, much more organized here. We've got our, our cut vegetables and our you know vegetables that don't fit in the crisper drawers. We've got the lettuces up here. We got clovers left over bone up there. <laughs> That's where it belongs. All of the uh, condiments are sorted. We've got drink stuff over here, but also some drink stuff over here, and that's okay. And the last of the soy sauce, I have a new soy sauce, so that's ready to go. Got condiments over here. Everything that's on the door is the stuff that can stand the warmer temperatures. I've done a video on this before. I will link it down below, even though it's really bad, and I'm probably going to do an updated video. Uh, but look, yes, looks much better now. Organized the crisper drawers, so those are good now, ready to go. Everything's categorized correctly. If you don't know which goes in which crisper drawer, there is, woo, there is something you can download for free on my website. I will put a link to it down below. It is which stuff goes with which in the crisper drawer. So some things are ethylene sen sensitive and some things are producing ethylene those things should go together. So there on my website, I will put a link down below. It's free. And of course, this is now sorted out. This was a mess. Still is not that great uh, because uh, some people, some people are buying eggs in like enormous amounts. I don't know why we have so many eggs. So uh, I will ask my husband about that later, but, and we also have too much cheese. <laughs> but uh, we've got a, little, a few little things of meat. We got some beef there and a couple, little bacon, uh, but that's all we've got for meat in the fridge right now. So this is not as bad as it was before, and uh, it's making me a little more less, a little less. It's making me a little less stress. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna put this up here. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's stressing me out. It's stressing me right out. There. That looks better. Sort of. All right, the fridge is clean and refreshed and I feel good. I'm gonna film another video and uh, then have some lunch. So if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you guys didn't enjoy this video, give it a big thumbs down. And uh, if you like content like this, please subscribe, you know. Go ahead, do it, it's free. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye, stay neat. Every time I'm down here, you make me smile You're the solution